French officials say the man suspected of brandishing a 12-gauge shotgun at two media outlets and a bank headquarters and severely wounding a photographer's assistant was found on a tip-off in an underground car park where he had tried to commit suicide. Delano D'Souza reports. 52-year-old Abdel Hakim Dekar, the lone suspect arrested on Wednesday as he lay unconscious in an underground parking lot, has been indicted and remanded in custody. Reacting to the news, his lawyer said the police investigation is now over and so are, I hope, the violations of his right to be presumed innocent and statements by people who have nothing to do with the case commenting on my client's motives. A nationwide manhunt was underway following the shooting of a photographer's assistant at the office of the newspaper Libération and a second incident where shots were fired outside Société Générale in the business district of La Défense. Police say the shooter was the same man who stormed into the offices of BFM TV on November 15th, threatening staff before rushing out. According to officials, Dekar's DNA matched samples collected from the scenes of Monday's attacks. Dekar is no stranger to the authorities. He has previously been charged for his role in a 1994 killing spree, providing a weapon that claimed the lives of three policemen and a taxi driver.